Member Polworth. Uh, thank you, Speaker. And I rise today to, to put on the record, and I'll be writing to you later today, Speaker, seeking advice on the use of parliamentary office CCTV to issue uh, severe and harsh fines to members of the public who, come to, who have come to my office in the last two weeks. On October 15, more than 20 fines were issued to my constituents who came to see me about genuine concerns on a range of issues with the way their businesses, their families and their own individual circumstances have been dealt with during this pandemic. At the time, at the time, those constituents were allowed across the road at Aldi, across the road at Bunnings, are allowed across the road at the BWS. There were no restrictions on movement in Colac at the time. The local police had no inclination to find these people, but, but uh, Speaker, uh, this parliament has handed over the CCTV to police officials to issue fines against my constituents. Those same constituents then came to my office again this past Saturday, October 23rd, where more than 30 people were allowed to, at one spot. They came to see me about their fines. And guess what, Speaker? The police turned up again. Not only did they interrogate and intimidate uh, people who'd come to my office to speak to me, they also did to myself questioning, uh, wanting names of who the people were at my office. Speaker, this is a gross invasion of parliamentary privilege. It should not be stood for. And if this government gets its way with new pandemic legislation, those same constituents could have had multi-thousand dollar fines. Order. Order. Just, just before calling Member for Albans, um, the Member for Polworth has raised um, what I believe to be a genuine concern he has about an issue of privilege. I'll just remind members that there are appropriate forms for the matters of privilege to be raised. And I'd be happy to uh, meet with the member after uh, I leave the chair with the clerk to discuss those matters with him. Member for St Albans.